<laughs> me. Yeah, Piper's playing with you, huh? So yes, Piper Mom. and Keys Keys are home. And it's they're gonna dog. It is a school night and they're gonna play some play-doh, right? Together. Good morning guys okay so uh, oh, I'm tired <laughs> so it is a Monday morning Mondays are always the worst like they're just always the most difficult so all three kids are on the bus we barely made it this morning you guys and it's very odd because I woke up like 45 minutes earlier than I normally wake up so that I could I actually cook breakfast instead of just doing cereal for the kids so that I could actually you know fix their hair nice or whatever. It just didn't go as I had planned. Like, Zoe and Piper were kind of just not in a good mood this morning. They were kind of at each other's throats and I don't know. And Piper took 20 minutes to eat her toast. <laughs> she finished everything else, but then sat there for 20 minutes insisting that she had to finish that toast. So, I know I'm making myself a little bit of breakfast. So, <sighs> Just a rough morning. Zoe went to school without her hair done <laughs> at all. It is brushed though and it is clean. So really, what more can I ask for? Um, Aiden is still dead asleep. Excuse me, Aiden is still dead asleep. Um, usually my plan is I get them off of the bus, I get them on the bus at seven. And then I go in his room and I get him up and I bring him upstairs and breakfast and then we do our homeschool. Well, it's around 8.30 now and I went, just went down to check on him and he's still asleep, you guys. I also had to go down to his room twice in the night last night to kind of calm him. Um, he was just, he wasn't like upset or anything, but he was just playing and loud and I just, I went in and rubbed his back a little bit and you know, trying to settle him a little bit. He eventually went to sleep for the night around like 2 a.m. Like that's kind of when he settled in for good. but. I am expecting him to sleep at least another 30 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat some breakfast and get some coffee going before I go back down to check on him. Look who's up. <laughs> Look who's up. Came straight upstairs in a stealing brother's minion. <laughs> I love you. Silly Bowie, you leave your pants on. You leave those pants on. Yeah. Yes. You gonna cover up? You gonna go back to bed? Silly bow. So, literally, you guys, like 10, 15 minutes after I turned the camera off that last time, I heard him downstairs awake. So, he didn't sleep much past like 8.45. So, not too bad. He had his breakfast, he came up and played a little bit, and he wandered back there to play like he usually does. I think he's learning the homeschool routine. Like he's kind of getting the hang of it. Um, so I make him feed himself breakfast. He knows that he has to self feed. Um, and I will try to film that tomorrow. Um, he had oatmeal with some peanut butter and a little bit of brown sugar and some applesauce. So that was his breakfast. Um, yeah, he kind of just knows the routine. So he has breakfast, he gets to play a little bit while I edit or, you know, clean up the kitchen or do whatever it is that I have to do. And then usually at 9.30 or 10, we will start homeschooling. Um, the first like week that I homeschooled him, it was like, girls get on bus, Narkees gets on the bus, boom, Aiden starts homeschool. Like that's how I did it. But um, the last couple days I really realized that giving him a break even like just a 30 minute break between breakfast and the time we actually start is super helpful i think it makes him feel like he has a chance to play and unwind or whatever i don't know anyway i am going to sit down for a minute i'm gonna have some coffee i'm going to work on editing and then aiden and i are going to do homeschool i'm going to fold clothes i'm going to finish cleaning up my kitchen and probably do some dusting because when I was downstairs getting Aiden I noticed like on top of the girls dollhouse and stuff there's a little bit of dust so I need to get that done today as well all right guys so I just got out of the shower oh can y'all tell look at my hair 
it like does that thing where it like sticks straight out. Anyway, I got a lot accomplished today. <laughs> I made a bunch of phone calls. I got all of my dishes done. I got half of the laundry folded, which I still need to do the other half. I edited the vlog. The vlog is now live. Um, and Aiden and I did about an hour and a half of homeschool. We got an hour and a half in. Um, I was going to film him, but it was one of those moments like I didn't intend to do homeschool in the moment that I did because I was feeding him lunch and uh, he just was so responsive and alert and he was saying mom over and over which we've been working on the m -m -m kind of syllable um, or sound rather and uh, he was just doing it on his own. He was doing like the more sign on his own and I just seized the moment, you guys, and I just ran with it. So he finished his lunch and we did about an hour and a half of homeschool. And he did amazing, you guys. I am just, some days, you guys, I'm just blown away by that kid. I'm blown away by him every day, but you know, you know what I mean. There are certain days he's definitely more attentive and more in tune to listening and like what I'm trying to teach him, if that makes sense. But. Anyway, it was a good day. Got a lot done. Got some appointments done. Aiden has his um, psych evaluation tomorrow. Now, he's already seen the psychologist, but he is going to actually have a full-on eval where they sit and are asking me questions and they're observing him and that kind of thing. And it's going to take about two hours. So he has that tomorrow at 3.30. I probably will not be able to film any of that. I'm just being honest because it's definitely... Um, a me sitting there talking to them sort of thing. So anyway, I am just standing down here, hanging out, waiting on the buses. Um, hoping the kids had a good day at school. Y'all, Zoe went to school this morning. Her hair looked a hot mess. And it kind of drives me crazy when she goes to school like that because she'll come home and it'll be in like tight, like ringlets of knots. Ah, we were so crunched for time this morning. I think I told you guys that though. And I woke up early and we still were like chomping at the bit um, for time. <sighs> anyway, I think I hear their buses. All right, the girls are doing a dance for us. Oh, beautiful. This is a long secret. <laughs> Good job. Oh, baby, baby, baby. Yeah, Piper's playing with you, huh? Yes, so Piper Mom. and Keys Keys are home. And is they're gonna a school dog? It is a school night and they're gonna play some Play-Doh, right? Together. Yeah, well, together. <laughs> Zoe's over there doing some art and then when she's finished we're gonna do her homework, right? Mama. Even guys, I made an Elsa for you. Made an Elsa? Oh, that's a beautiful Elsa. Open. Get him some out. They're awake. Okay. Have to okay, be um, gentle with the play. So I made a really pretty Open picture. Really it's nice. really it's really very beautiful. nice. And yeah. this tree goes no, down no, right there. Don't, Those don't are all the doors. And mm -hmm. this is the oh, window. Nice. I love it. More. Which one do you like? Um, there's orange and what are these all colors again? You know the colors. Purple. That's purple. You're right, Narkees. Yellow, black, teal, blue, pink. Da da. Well, you have to go with these. Oh, Mommy, yeah. I wanted to show you something. White. Cool. Green. Mama, apples. Orange. Orange. Okay, guys. <laughs> all four kids are in bed. It is about 7.30. Um, I got them down probably 10-15 minutes early, but I know the girls are not asleep right now. They they never go to sleep exactly like when I put them to bed. So I'll put them to bed and then I usually give them like a 30 minute window for them to settle down. And if they haven't settled down in those 30 minutes, that's when I go down and start laying down the law that they have to settle and get to sleep. But anyway. I think I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go. I think today's vlog was probably pretty short. Um, but you know, just to hang out at home, Kalina and editing kind of day. 
so what can you do anyway i will talk to you guys tomorrow if you guys are all doing awesome oh i just remembered aiden has his two and a half hour evaluation tomorrow that is not going to be fun um <clears throat> i hope he i know it sounds bad to say but i actually hope he has like a rough time while we're there um, just so that they can see kind of his behavior and what we're dealing with and it'll help them better judge as well like what he needs and what's going on with us so I don't know I never can tell I've, normally I would never in a million years wish for my child to have a, a hard a hard time or a difficult time but you know I guess sometimes in the instances of doctor's appointments and whatever it can be a good thing. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go. Don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe if you are new. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow. And don't forget, always live to inspire. Bye, guys.